Good day, everybody. We welcome you on today's episode of Finance 101. We have a big news story that just hit and it is taking the Philippines by storm. If you have not heard about it yet, then here's the 411. If you've ever considered growing your funds and investing from the comfort of your own home, then you must meet our first guest for today, si Ashong Asenso. Si Ashong Asenso? Vintage man ang damit. G na G pa rin. Nax, may butal sa bulsa. G invest na to? Kasi isang ID lang, makakapag-invest ka na sa trusted local at global companies for as low as 50 pesos. Kaya ang investment mo, pwedeng maging negosyo over time. G, invest na! How amazing and heartfelt was that story. If you guys have ever considered starting your business like a pro, then you can unlock your life goals and be smart with your money. Check out Gcash's in-app feature called G-Invest to start investing your money for as low as 50 pesos. You heard that right. All you need is to register one valid ID to verify your Gcash account to get access to trusted local and global funds. So, alam na yan, guys. Tara, G! Invest na tayo. Now, I would like to introduce to you our special guest for today to share her own experience with G Invest. Our guest is Miss Ariana Epperson. Oh my gosh, so shy. Hi. Thank you so much for having me on the show. Hi, I'm Ariana Epperson, guys. Actually, I wanted to share my G Invest experience with you guys. It's really super easy. All I have to do is really just verify my Gcash account, and you need one valid ID for that and an email address. It's really just as easy as opening the app and clicking on the G Invest icon to start your investment journey. After signing up, they make me answer a risk assessment questionnaire. This is just to determine your risk appetite. So you answer a bunch of questions, and it will help, I guess make you decide what funds you want to start investing in. When I took mine, I got moderate. So since I was a student, I was very, very keen on saving up money. I was already a working student at the time, so anything I had, I tried to put away. But as I got older, I realized in order to kind of prepare myself for the future, it's not just about saving, but also investing and diversifying my investments by putting money away in different places. And it was very easy actually to start putting money away in G-Invest because the barriers to entry is very low, where you could pretty much start investing for as low as 50 pesos minimum. So there are actually multiple kinds of funds that are available on the app that are run by very trustworthy local and global companies. So the different kind of investment products that are available are the ALFM Global Multi-Asset Income Fund, we have the Philippine Stock Index Fund, the Atram Peso Money Market Fund, the Atram Global Consumer Trends Fund, we have the Atram Total Return Peso Bond Fund, the Atram Philippine Equity Smart Index Fund, and the Atram Global Technology Feeder Fund. So based on this and my risk appetite, the ones that are most suitable for me would actually be the Atram Total Return Peso Bond Fund. But the more that I'm getting into this app, the more I realized I want to also put into different ones, so I also put mine into the Atram Global Technology Feeder Fund. So I've actually been using G-Invest for a while now, but there are two new funds, which are the ALFM Global Multi-Asset Income Fund and the Philippine Stock Index Fund, which is actually backed by BPI. What's super awesome is that you can go and track your orders and even monitor the value of your investments just through the app itself. And if you're forgetful like I am, you can actually set a bi-weekly, monthly, or quarterly reminder so that you get notified every time so you don't forget to put in some money into your investments. But then again, when it comes to this, I feel like there's such low pressure putting money in. I just try to put away what I can, when I can. When I make a little money here, I decide to put away a certain amount into my investments, some into my savings, and some just a little bit for myself, you know? Because we have to treat ourselves. And I know that sometimes you can be stuck in the whole thing, I need to save for my future, but you also need to learn how to treat yourself when you need to. With still having the security of knowing, 
ah, I have some money saved up too. So we have to really be responsible with our money. But then again, when it comes to investments, you cannot always expect that the return will be instant. You know, that's why it's called an investment. We are taking the time and the chance to hope that our money grows and I'm really in this for the long run. So just like the first guest that was on today's show, like Ashrang Asenso, you can turn your 50 pesos into something more and even have it grow your business. And because of investing, I was able to start two of my online businesses, which are Always Sunday and All Peachy. So thank you so much for having me on the show. I'm so happy I got to share my G Invest experience and I hope other people learn something from it too. So thank you, it's me, Ariana Everson, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much, Miss Ariana, for being on our show today. We really appreciated you sharing your insights and of course your experience with G Invest. So guys, tada, if you want to unlock your life goals at the push of a button, then when they end, G Invest when they end, guys. So once again, it's been me, your reporter, and I will see you guys on the next episode. Bye!